get you out of my space. And I need it, baby, I'm late, but I. Um, today is Monday, Monday, the September 23rd, and it's currently 12.50 or 1 o'clock, and I just got out of class. Um, I only had two classes today, but, I only had two classes today, but this, um, video is going to be a, um, like, after class routine or whatever, so, um, I just got lunch and I'm about to eat that and then after that I have to go later today I have to go to the library because I need to get my work done and I usually go to the library like from 4 to like 6 and get my work done and then at 7 30 I have Bible study and then after that it's just like I go home and then do like my regular like night routine but yeah, I just wanted something to record because I haven't recorded. But y'all, I went to class today. Forgot my glasses. I picked up the wrong glasses. I couldn't see, but I thought they was the right glasses. And then I put the glasses on and realized I still couldn't see. So I thought I was tripping and I took the glasses off. Like to clean them. Whole time. Whole time, y'all. OMG. Oh, yeah. Whole time, I had the wrong glasses. I have these like glasses that's like, like for fashion, but they're clear glasses, and they're bigger than my actual glasses. But I couldn't see, so I just picked up. They were right beside each other, so I just picked up the first one that I seen. I don't know. I wasn't thinking this morning, but yeah, I picked up the wrong glasses, so I was in class struggling to see. Which is so crazy like I never I never did something like that before so yeah but overall my day was okay class was fast I got out of class early both of my classes early. and yeah now I'm about to go eat I got American Deli I eat American Deli like every week it's a problem it's the same exact thing y'all put me on to some some good wing combos because I eat the same one yeah. And I got flowers, guys. Ouch. I got flowers. So nice, right? So sweet. Flowers and food. I'm just a girl. I also have two videos that I have to edit, so I'm probably going to try to get that done in the library, too. We'll see. On top of my work. Which is sick. But, yeah, I'm going to get back to y'all when I get in the house, and um, yeah. Okay, guys, I'm back. I got my food and my flowers. I only get flowers on special occasions, guys, but it's cool. But I'm about to eat my food and watch the baddies and um, I'll be back later after I'm finished doing that. So, yeah. Okay guys, I just made it on camp. It's like 4 o'clock or whatever, so I'll be here like from 4 to 7.30 um, doing work or whatever. But I know last time I seen me, I was at my house, so I just have wanted to make sure that I came and checked on y'all before I um, popped up in the library. And y'all be like, did she teleport to the library? <laughs> but yeah, so that's what I'm doing, and I will see y'all when I get in the library. I don't really like recording on campus, so yeah. Okay guys, we made it into the library, and... I got Starbucks. This is an iced caramel macchiato with three pumps and caramel. Um, this is really basic coffee. So if you don't know about this, I don't really, I don't know, you know? But if you don't know about it, you know, try it. It's like semi-sweet, semi-coffee. I feel like I look lopsided. Oh, don't wait, y'all. I can't hear this horrible. But, y'all, I was on the way here, and somebody stopped me on campus to sell some clothes or whatever 
I bought this. It's a windbreaker. It says this says young swan heaven sent. Uh I am with you always in the name of Jesus. Amen. Or in Jesus' name. Amen. Same thing, same thing. But yeah, it's cute. Sixty dollars, but it's okay. I don't have a windbreaker, so this will be the only windbreaker I'll be buying anytime soon. But yeah, I was just supporting the local business, you know. But right now, I'm about to do some work and edit. I'm with Ray. Hi, guys. Hi. How y'all doing? Be in the tech room. I mean, in the... What is this one called? This one. It's trying to be productive, do some work. Hope you guys are having an amazing day. It's a beautiful Monday. It's hot outside, but the Lord woke us up this morning. Amen. So we gotta be thankful, even if your day ain't going great. Be you got stuff to be grateful for. Period. If you're called, let you get your work done. Okay. I gotta tell myself. I gotta tell her that all the time. No, she lying now. Even when we be in here, she be on her phone. I be like, hey, do your work. You know, sometimes, sometimes you just be needing that encouragement. Like, you just don't be feeling like doing nothing for real. Yeah. That's what it was giving. But, yeah. I'm about to lock in, y'all. Um. It's a little. It's <laughs> just still sweet. Oh. They probably put, they probably did their heavy hand caramel. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Alright y'all, so we are going to Bible study now. It is 7.30 and we just left the library. We was actually being productive. We got some good work done. Or whatever. So yeah, Bible study is on campus so we're just walking there. But I just came to update you guys um, about what I'm doing. So yeah, Bible study is not on, never on time. It's 7.35. She's on the exec board. And... Um, <laughs> I'm just saying, it's not just her though. It's all of them. You know, black people never on time. It's nothing personal though. So yeah, I will see y'all later and keep y'all updated. First, I'm just shut up, the silence, cause you about to mess up the whole thing. And some of y'all are not about to shut you up. Okay, guys, it's kind of late. Hold on, wait. Okay, guys, it's kind of late, but um, I just left Bible study. I don't really be recording or don't be wanting to record in Bible study because it's Bible study like you're supposed to be listening not like <laughs> recording but I'll share when I get home I can share like what we was talking about or whatever oh and also yeah I don't like talking I like I don't like um I don't like recording in Bible study because people be like people be so negative and so like doing too much and I, I don't iron with that so yeah, yeah. 
But Tiana, oh, y'all can't even see. Tiana's behind me and Danny's okay. somewhere. Yes, Bible study was good. Um, I learned that sometimes you have to let, you gotta. Let God do it. Let God do it. Because oh, we had asked for, we had asked for two cents in the back. Can't even see her. <laughs> yes, but that was gonna say sometimes you gotta let God do his thing and you can't always be negative in life, you know? Yeah. Speak positive. Speak positive positive things into your life. That's what we learned today. To be quiet and watch our mouths. Mm -hmm. yep. yep. Oh, here you go. Here's Danny. Hello. Oh, you can't still can't see Danny boy. Danny black, y'all. Hold on. Hey. Where y'all going? Is it Nathan? I think we're supposed to go that way. Where y'all going? Yeah, but see that's that way. Hold on. Good morning vlog. Come on, bro, for you to cross that pool. Good morning vlog. Oh, it's Danny. <sighs> Y'all pray for Danny, man. And this TikTok. Can't stay off TikTok. That's a TikTok fiend. TikTok fiend, y'all. Go follow me. Um, SZA1.0. What? That's, that's my, my username. SZA1.0. SZA? What? SZA. S-Z-A. Why? Well, I mean, S-Z-A. Exactly. 1.0. Because people say that me and SZA look alike. They do. Tight. Wait, Okay guys, I am now home, so I'm going to sh like basically share with y'all what we talked about in Bible study. Um, hold on, I'm trying to get on my bed. So in the Bible study, we basically talked about watching our mouths and stop speaking negative negatively or speaking speaking too much. Because sometimes we have the habit of doubting ourselves and just saying negative things or we say too much, telling too much of our business, running too much of them gums to the wrong people. So basically that was what it was about. One of the... Um, one of the verses that we looked at was Luke 1 through 20 or Luke 1 through 1 through 11 it then like 18 through 20 and basically um basically 18 through 20 says Zechariah asked the angel how can I be sure of this I am an old man and my wife is well along in the years the angel said to him I am Gabriel I stand in the presence of God and I have been sent to speak to you and tell you this good news and now you will be silent and not and not able to speak until the until the day happens and now you will and now you will be silent and not able to speak until the day this happens because you did not believe my words which will come true at the appointed time so yeah basically what we learned was um hold on y'all pause some of the notes i wrote down was god is the person of destiny so he knows our destiny before we even know it. So we should just trust him and surrender to him and trust that what he says is what is going to happen. Even if we have a little doubt, we should just trust God. And sometimes we speak, what we, so, and sometimes what we speak is the truth, but the truth doesn't need to be said. Sometimes you might say things too much to people who one, don't believe, two, don't believe in you, or three, are praying against you. And you don't need none of that none of that around you another thing i got is why pray about something but when god gives it to you you turn it down because it's, not, it's you turn it down because it wasn't the time or the place that you wanted it or how you wanted it and that is selfish because you asked for it and he gave it to you when you needed it most or when you were prepared for it and you turned it down you turned it down that's how you feeling yeah you're crazy you're crazy the reason why god might have not answered your prayers when you needed them answered or thought you needed them answered was be he was allowing you to keep preparing for the day that he actually answered your prayer you might have asked for it when you weren't prepared you probably weren't mentally there you probably weren't physically there you probably 
didn't know what you could do without that prayer. And now you could do 10 times more when he answers. You see what I'm saying? Like, that's what Bible study was about. Um, it was pretty good. I liked it. Um, I usually go to Bible study often. Um, I've been slipping low key, but I'm getting back on track. And yeah, um, I hope this word finds somebody who needs it and just speak positive, positively on your life at all times, guys. Just stay positive no matter what it is and just pray. Uh, right now, I'm about to get in the shower and, you know, wind down a little bit, figure out what I'm going to eat for dinner and finish up some work. So, yeah, I'm about to get in the shower. So, I'll probably hit y'all after. <gasps> oh, excuse me. I'll probably hit y'all after I get out the shower. So, yeah. Okay, guys, now that we are out the shower, we're about to do our skincare routine. But y'all don't see my skincare routine like 6,000 times. So, I'm gonna just like do a little TikTok move real quick. So, yeah. Okay guys, now that I am basically done with my night like washing and hygiene and stuff, I'm about to just, I'm not really hungry so I'm probably not going to eat nothing tonight. I know that's probably not healthy but I really don't eat a lot y'all. So I'm probably just going to chill and like just do some work or whatever and whatever else I need to do until I get tired and watch Young and Rest Reckless on TV. So I'll keep y'all updated and like come back before I go to sleep. But my body look crazy. But if you um like this vlog, make sure you give it a thumbs up. If you got this far, give it a thumbs up and comment a purple heart. Period. And um yeah. Um yeah, that's what I that's just thought it y'all so I'll be back to update y'all before I go to sleep.